you too, it's pee. being productive like always you guys watch my videos you guys know I'm all about getting my life together being productive and trying new hobbies out but on today's agenda we are going to reset for spring mind you when you guys are watching this video spring has already been in full motion but this is your sign if you haven't reset for spring decluttered everything been productive done your taxes because you waited till last minute like me get it done girl get rid of that procrastination as you guys can tell my room is an entire mess it is so filthy on the top of my to-do list is to wash my sheets and my comforter they are way overdue i like doing it like about every week and i think it's been about a month which is way way too long for me because this should be getting done every single week mind you i was traveling i wasn't here every single day but still first let's declutter the bed oh diggy i'm gonna have to get off of the bed baby The other day ricardo spilled coffee on one of our chairs so it's so freaking dirty now i'm gonna try to use this laundry stain remover hopefully it'll help it like soften it up and then we'll go in with the vacuum that we have so i'll leave this on for like an hour or so Ricardo, really? What? I just noticed what you did. What are you, a child? Oh, I'm labeling the new little system that I have up there. I already put granola, snacks, chiles, and then this one's just gonna be for extras. I use this label maker. It's from Imo. It's honestly so rusty. It's already linked on my Amazon storefront if you guys wanna get it. I've had it for like three or four years already. That, put it on this. This one's kind of deformed. It ruins the vibe, but we're gonna leave it for now. There we go. That's our new organization system. It's already dark outside. I did start cleaning a little bit later today. You guys, my sleeping schedule has been so messed up. Last night, we were trying to finish up all of our like accounting and finances and get that all sorted out so we could go get our taxes done. We were actually supposed to go today, but we literally want to sleep like at almost 4 a.m. We woke up late today, and so this video started on a rough note. I'm not going to drink any coffee today, but I am going to make some strawberry, or not strawberry matchas, just regular matchas for Ricardo and I. Wait, babe, do you want a coffee? coffee. Oh, never mind. I'm doing a coffee for Ricardo and a matcha for me. We're going to take our coffee. I've been looking for the ice version of this, but I haven't been able to find it. You guys know where to find it please let me know also that noise in the background is the ice maker so don't mind that since i just took some ice out it's like making more i'm gonna make a like nara smith inspired video so i bought this little mug that is so cute it has its like little poster i guess oh, i'm gonna use it to make the matcha right now do the aesthetic coffee and matcha <laughs> matcha with some sweet cream mm. i haven't had a matcha in a little while so that definitely hit i've been doing the coffee this is ricardo's so i'm gonna try it let's see how it came out oh my gosh this one's so good too i'm kind of jelly but this one's gonna be for ricardo he is cleaning our couches right now the coffee stain that it has has been marinating for about two hours now he's doing that so let's go take this Couches that Ricardo was cleaning. Oh my gosh, that fabric stain remover that I used worked so well. And you could definitely tell where I sprayed that stain remover because where I cut off, like where I stopped, like from then moving on, it's like so dark still. I ended up telling Ricardo to stop cleaning the couches. I was like, there's no point of him wasting all of his time and energy. No matter how much he scrubbed, it wasn't gonna come off. He's done that in the past and it doesn't come off. That's why I'm so happy that I tried doing that now. It means that next time he does it he'll just scrub a little bit and it'll come off it's supposed to be a stain remover for laundry i mean i guess it's cloth so if you have like a stain on something that you have been trying to remove and you have that tight stain remover definitely give it a go because it worked wonders for me my favorite smell is when i just did laundry or when my sheets are clean because 
the room smells like so fresh sheets smell so fresh best feeling ever though is taking an everything shower and then laying in freshly washed sheets so bomb anyways for the rest of the night i'm gonna sip on my matcha we're gonna clean the nightstands vacuum a little bit and we're gonna go to sleep because tomorrow we have to go do taxes <laughs> the saddest day of the year for me Messy bed. Clothes are hanging off the shelf. Good morning. Well, not so morning anymore. It is 2 21 p.m. We just got here to our tax location. Proto got off to get in line. It seems like there's a lot of people in front of us. But aside from that, you guys, allergies are freaking kicking my butt. This whole ride here, I had like a tissue up my nose because I didn't want to mess up my makeup. I was feeling cute, and then all of a sudden snot all over my face so i was just like sticking papers up my nose spring season is good but when it comes to allergies it's no joke this is me post taxes but it's over with don't have to deal with that until next year again we are now gonna go shopping for all the spring essentials and groceries we need to make everything from scratch tomorrow i'm making a nara smith inspired video so we need to get all of the essentials so we're gonna hop by walmart first and then we're gonna go to world market to get some cute spring essentials and also ross let's go All right, we found the dill. It's like a mission to even find any of this because I don't even know how it looks. Ricardo found some parsley. We're getting that. Mission, find basil. Wait, it's two ninety eight for the plant. Should I just buy the plant? What do you I mean, if they have the plant, I think they have to have the thing. And then, and then I can plant the basil. Okay, fine. Yes! Wait, it's two ninety eight for the whole plant? All right, which plant's better? This one. I've actually also decided I'm going to become a gardener for this video because it's giving spring vibes and it's giving she's in her wholesome era. So we're going to plant the basil plant. And this is going to be my first thing. <laughs> we need to buy fertilizer and a pot and all of that stuff too. Mission find everything <laughs> has been completed. We have all of the necessary ingredients plus some cranberry juice. That's the one thing. Oh, 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 okay. <laughs> Baby, we have all the ingredients. I'm gonna feed you with homemade Finally. meals. Finally, I've been having to cook ever since we moved. Shut up. I actually stuck to my list today for, for once. First. It's a spring miracle. Let's go pay and then go shopping for more things. We made it to Ricardo's favorite place. Look at him. He is so happy right now. Well, I'm just here to see if they have any spring decor. If they don't, it's okay because we're gonna go to World Market anyways. Hello. Found this Paris Hilton sheet for $5.99 and it's pink in the back. So I'm gonna take it for tomorrow. Use it to bake my Oops. Cinnamon Toast Crunch. Ooh, I need this for all the orange juices I've been doing in my juicer lately. And it's only $3.99. <gasps> yes, we need to make orange juice. I'm taking this. I don't know for what, but it'll come in handy tomorrow. It's so cute too. It's pink. This is specifically what I had came for. I thought they would have like a cute throw blanket for my chairs that would give spring vibes, but they don't have any. I thought Target could have some cute spring stuff, but honestly, it doesn't have that much in stock. It's all green stuff, so I'm gonna pass on Target, which is also a good thing for my pockets because Target supplies and everything decoration is always super expensive. A win's a win. Update! We have acquired all of the essential groceries that we're gonna need for tomorrow's video. I'm also really oily. Please don't mind that. Like, it's been a stressful day. This is the part that I'm the most excited for because I've never been to a world market, and by what I've seen online, kind of like a hobby lobby slash michael store so i'm looking for a pink plant that i could add a little bit of a pop of color spring vibe to my room i also ordered two or three flower pillows from amazon that are gonna get delivered till tomorrow so i'll show you guys when those arrive here is the store guys look i can already see from the outside all of these containers <laughs> yeah Big why is you scared oh my god i already found them <gasps> Ricardo, shut what am I looking They're at? They're so cute. Hold this. What am I looking at? Here they are. Tell me these aren't cute. They're really cute, baby. They're giving cherry blossom. This is being your new favorite store, huh? Nope. I'm 
kind of overwhelmed but also like so excited i want every single thing in here i just know i don't have the budget or the space for it but like oh, i can't believe i had never walked into a world market before everything is beautiful we discovered this one section that has candies from like all over the world hands world market ah. germany we got ricardo got this wait did you get the oreo one baby no, i got the caramel oh this one so we're gonna try this one out all the chocolates are from a different place and it also like tells you so you know where you're getting it from i've seen people try these matcha ones which kind of intrigues me but i think i'm not like a fan of like matcha in sweets japan treats Whoa. box looks so cool anyways, anyways. back Whoa, to the <gasps> there's more no way how much stuff do they have they have like not only chocolates and sweets <gasps> they have they have snacks, babe. Oh They're God, chips. chips. These are Lay's from oh where? God, China. I'm gonna have to come here. For what? Time. They're fried crab flavor. Hello Kitty barbecue chips. The TikTok girlies have not gotten a hold of this or like don't know this exists because there is way too much Hello Kitty stuff going on right now. Hello Kitty seaweed. Babe, look. They have a Biscoff cookie butter. I think they sell this one at Walmart, actually. Oh, <gasps> babe. Remember we wanted to try this the other day? Yeah. It's honeycomb. An ASMR with this we found the bulldog hot sauces i wanted to get this sauce like so bad some time ago and i couldn't find it anywhere they had it here the this whole time. You were looking at oh yeah they have that one at target though oh. they have the pink one and the red one so for sure some of the stuff they have here like we already know where to get yeah they do have the pink bulldog noodles they're 8.99 though so the stuff is a little bit more expensive babe oh they have drinks back here i'm going to try to make a strawberry fresh drink so i'm gonna get this poppy i know they sell this one at target i don't know why they have it here but okay poppy strawberry syrup we have right there and cranberry juice probably all the groceries i just bought I'm putting away. I can't believe I actually bought a whole ass basil plant. And I definitely want to plant this and stuff, but I won't have enough time today because it's already like 10 p.m. Thankfully, I'm getting sleepy already, which means that if I go to sleep early today, I'll wake up early tomorrow and my sleeping schedule is fixed. I hate waking up late, but it's been happening the past couple of days. So let's put our groceries away. There you go. Die. And then here are the cute tulips that I bought from Trader Joe. This one's all moldy. That's so cute. What happened? It's all moldy, babe. We need to really take out this moldy part. I'm gonna cut a little bit of the stem. Put them in here. Oh, this one's broken. Here are the tulips tomorrow morning so that they wake up like perfectly standing. You're supposed to add a penny from before 1984, I believe. So I have mine that Ricardo just found for me. It's gonna go in the water. And then other hacks for tulips standing up straight, I think, is like adding sugar and all of those. Honestly, the penny method has worked really well for me in the past. I'm gonna do it again this year. Um, hopefully tomorrow they're like standing so pretty. I'll show you guys a picture of them. But yes, these are my spring flowers. We're gonna put them right here for now. Right now we have these green plants that I bought Ooh, from Target. But you guys know I bought these ones, which are also gonna be put in here. I think they're gonna be too long though, so I'm gonna have to cut them. Yeah, for sure need to cut them. So cute! It is officially time to remove this makeup for the day. It was a pretty productive day today. We were literally out the entire day. Can't complain because we're able to work, we're able to do taxes. Just reminding yourself that every day is special no matter what. The next day. Welcome to my vanity slash closet. Don't mind how my hair is looking. I've been having a bad hair morning, but it's also been a couple days. At this point, it's almost summer. <laughs> it is time to tackle this area of my space now. Look, I can't even like sit down and actually fully do my makeup. It's not spring vibes of me or anything like that. Let me tell you guys a little bit about what has been new in my life. For Ricardo and I's channel, we have been filming more of like a lifestyle vlog recently. For the past couple of months, we have been doing more like traveling videos. We hiked a volcano. You know, we traveled in our car for about a week, but we have been taking it chill. I've been enjoying being at home. I think I'm almost like ready to start traveling again. It does take a little bit of a toll on your life because you just don't have routine anymore. It's really, really fun and I wouldn't change it for the world, but it's just, you just have no routine when you are traveling, especially doing things kind of like the car camping thing that we were doing. Like that was so, so far out of routine from us. But 
we decided that for four weeks we would film kind of like lifestyle related vlogs on our channel kind of like what i film here on my channel all the time but we would do it on edith and ricardo us romanticizing like our relationship having date nights and just all of that fun stuff and i've been really really enjoying it because it also makes me and ricardo like forces us to like want to have date nights and want to do special things for each other and it's been really fun i've been loving it i'm sure you guys what i've been unpacking about these sports bras hopefully they fit me i got them from costco i'm saying all this because we have been going to the gym back again we took a little break when we went to the volcano we kind of stopped going to the gym we had our trainer that we have been going to for about a year now at that point we had to make the harsh decision to decide that we were gonna start traveling a little bit more unfortunately our budget could not fit traveling and also having the trainer and also it was just like a time management issue as well because we would be gone for like days at a time and like all of this stuff after we came back from the volcano and the car camping and all that stuff we didn't have a trainer anymore and we also kind of felt a little bit burnt out from training for a year and from traveling so we did take like a good like month and a half break from the gym which we hadn't done in over a year we literally would go to the gym four to five times a week for a whole year oh Thanks very much. Thank you. Carter just brought me my tea in this little cute mug that I bought yesterday. I was saying that I kind of fell into a funk. Oh, I also just bought these travel containers. This is what I was opening. Um, I'm putting them into my travel bag. I kind of fell into a funk. When you have a routine for so long and that's what you do every single day, you wake up knowing that this is what's going to get done today. And also the gym in itself, it helps you so much with like endorphins and feeling good. So when you stop doing that, it really messes with you. And it did for me at least. I was kind of going through it and I couldn't figure out what like what was going wrong because everything was going good like we had just done such amazing things and that's another thing too as well when you come back from a vacation like that post vacation depression is so real because you have just had like the time of your life and then boom you're back to your reality you know what I mean feeling better because I'm going back to the gym and I'm doing like my normal routine stuff like I'm gonna organize my fridge tomorrow all of that fun stuff I have been incorporating a lot more cardio into my routine yeah, I've been doing Stairmasters Stairmaster for 30 minutes one day this week i did 40 minutes i haven't seen many physical results yet but mentally i feel so much better it is my little ramble that i did two things with so i need to actually clean up because i'm gonna about to eat so let's clean up <laughs> Now that I have the pink sheets, I'm probably gonna put like the white one here. A flower opening a flower. Bro, stay. Oh, it looks pretty cute. I love that. 